Good afternoon. Welcome to America's Home Cooking. You know, at one time, candle making was done in the kitchen. It was cooking, preserving. They made their own soaps. They made their own detergents. All of these things. This is why the kitchen is called the heart of the home, because everything really had to come out of this kitchen. Now, somebody introduced this to me. If you have silverware or silver earrings and stuff and you don't want to use the harsh chemicals because they bother the earth and all, you can take some plain old baking soda. I've put some in here. And what I'm going to do, now these earrings are filthy, okay? I've been out in the yard and they're just really dirty and I haven't cleaned them in a while. What you do is take some cold water, just from the faucet, and what you're going to do is make a paste out of this baking soda. A friend introduced this to me because I told her, I, you know, I just hate getting silver jewelry and stuff because I have to clean it with those harsh chemicals, and I didn't like doing it. So she said, take baking soda and make a paste out of it. Don't make it liquidy, make it a paste. And that's what I'm going to do. And it does work because I got a lot of earrings and, and some silver jewelry. So it's really a nice, pleasant way of taking care. It's not harsh chemicals or anything. But what I do is I let it sit in this for a while. I bury it. Let it start working on it. It won't take long, just a few minutes. It's just like making toothpaste. Women had to make all these things. So when I say America's home cooking, I mean everything comes through this kitchen. There's, there wasn't much that didn't come through, and this is our heritage, you know? So I introduced these things and different things, and sometimes we'll go off the course of cooking food, and we might try, and I'll show you some other ways that you can do things. I mean, I make my detergent and now I spend, what, $50 and it lasts me six to eight months and I do a lot of clothes. So that is really nifty and I'll show you how I do that. Because I was spending $40 a, a month and that's just, just too much. And it's just like I just couldn't get ahead of myself and if I could sit there and, you know, save pennies. I've even gone to the point of making my own tooth powder, you know. I got that from the ARE, and uh, I've been using it for years with my husband, and my sons have used it. One son just gets overly fond of it, and when I make a couple of cups of it, it's gone in the week because he really likes it because he knows it works so well. So uh, these are, are tricks, and it's really simple. If you have basics in your house, you really don't have to worry. And all you do is, well, we'll go back to the jewelry. All I'm doing is rubbing it. If you have small little pieces or something, get an old toothbrush, you know, instead of throwing them out, collect it and use it. And it can get into those fine little crevices that you can't get into when you scrub it. Because I have three toothpaste, the old ones that I keep in the drawer here, and I do use them. It's like I had an old set and I kept a fork from the set, and I use it. And you see me when I'm making muffins and stuff, I say, get a fork. That's the fork. Instead of using what I'm using that we eat with, it's just an old fork from an old set from many, many years ago. And I'll just show you how nice this cleans up. You can see it's starting to turn gray a bit. That's because it's taking the tarnish off of the silver. And then you just rinse it with cold water and dry it. That's it. And they're clean. They're really clean and they sparkle. So it's a nice thing to have and it doesn't really hurt the earth or anything. And we have to care for her, you know. But this is just another way of making ends meet little things that you do. And you keep using the baking soda. I don't have to use all this for one set. If I had more, more, I would just use it and clean teapots, kettles, anything silver. You can, you can use this, and it's not harmful. Let's see if I got one really polished so you can see it. So 
So if somebody says the kitchen is the heart of the home, it really is. Women had to learn about all the herbs to cure even marijuana. That was a plant that they used in medicine as well. And they couldn't go to the store and buy soap, they had to make it. see how this one comes out now. Oh yes, you can see the distance. Down. And here it is. You see how bright it is now? It's nice and clean. I'll dry it. So instead of using harsh chemicals, you can use baking soda and some water. Just make it a paste, let it sit a bit, and there, it's all clean. Have a lovely evening and take care. Bye-bye.